So this is Gus. Gus, say hi. Um, he's a French bulldog and he's four years old. Uh, we got him actually this summer. Um, his owner was rehoming him. She lived on a farm and had too many dogs um, and other animals and they just weren't giving him the attention that he deserved. Stay right here though, buddy. Stay right here. Can you sit? Good boy. Um, I'll turn it so you can see him or maybe he might move. Um, he's fed, he's four years old, he's fed Yukonuba twice a day, um, and he's on a bit of a diet right now because he's a, a little meatier for, for a French bulldog. Um, he gets really small treats after he goes to the bathroom, um, and we give him no table scraps. He... Uh, would be very spoiled and greedy if we gave him table scraps. Um, he went to six week training. Um, his previous owner sent him to that. So he's really a obedient, um, knows lots of tricks, uh, walks right behind us, behind our legs, never strays from us. Um, when he's called to come, he comes right away. Um, he's actually scared of other dogs though. They say he thinks he's the chief in town, um, but I think he's scared. Uh, so he tries to attack other dogs when they get too close. Um, so we have to carry a squirt bottle with lemon around and he's like deathly afraid of it. So he like, if he sees us pull it out, he like cowers down. And so that's really helpful, but it's also a little, a little embarrassing when you run into a dog and you have to whip out your squirt bottle. Um, but then once he bonds with a dog, like I have an English bulldog, he's staying with my mom right now. Once he bonds with them, then he's obsessed with them and loves them so much. Um, and he was recently depressed when my English bulldog went to my mom's house to stay uh, for like a week straight. He would just sleep all day and looked really sad, but you're back to normal now, right Gus? Yes, you good boy. Um, he, he gets attached really easily to his humans. He always gives you a nice welcome when you get home and freaks out and grabs his bones and grabs his balls. Yeah, you, you like your balls. Those are your favorite toy. Where's your ball? Get your ball. Go get your ball. Go get your ball. Um, and also he loves uh, like plastic water bottles, milk cartons, uh, bones. He has a bone. I told him to get his ball, but he grabbed a bone. That works too, Gus. Um, and then I think fu something funny about him is that he snores really loudly. Like, he is a snore. Um, makes lots of noises, clearly, as he's, like, enjoying, indulging in his bone right now. And then that's, like, a little French bulldog. We love bulldogs here. So, yep, that's Gus.